Ryan Steinecker at Rich High School with Rick Larson, wrestling coach. Rick, thanks for your time today. Hey, thanks. Good to have you here. How'd the team do at Grace over the weekend? Uh, we had a good tournament up at Grace. Uh, it was set up as a dual meet tournament. Uh, we were in a, a pool with uh, Madison, which is a large school out of Rexburg. Uh, they they pretty much won the tournament. But then we wrestled uh, Grace and Soda in our first pool. Did well, about head-to-head with Grace. Uh, we handled Soda pretty easily. And then we ended up uh, wrestling Preston, which seems to be down a little. And we handled them pretty easily. And then there was a a renegade team, a team made up of the JV kids, which was a pretty solid team all the way through. And we had great matches there, and we we won almost all those as well. So good tournament for us. Pretty encouraged so far with what you're seeing from the guys getting in shape, just in practice and and that first meet. Yeah, this this has been the easiest group I've ever had, as in they want to work hard, they want to lift hard, they want to better themselves physically, mentally. And so practices have been great. I've told them we keep working like this, it pays off because we're going to be in better shape than our opponents. And, and it was quite apparent come going into the third round. Like I told them, third round was our round because we were in much better shape than the other schools at this point in the season. Others are going to catch up, though, later on, you think? Uh, eventually they'll catch up. But if you can maintain that edge and uh, uh, conditioning in the third round, I don't care how how hard do you work when two kids go at it for four straight minutes that fifth and sixth minute becomes a challenge and so if we can keep that edge and stay ahead of the competition keep lifting working hard yeah we're gonna end up pretty good this weekend you'll be at marsh valley right is it a lot of the same teams almost all the same teams and then an additional seven or eight teams it's it's a big tournament it's set up in pods Uh, instead of duels we just group them all together in groups of eight or nine, and so they wrestle eight, seven, eight matches each. Uh, it's a great tournament because they get lo- lots of wrestling, lots of experience. What positive things have you seen so far this season? You know, we're a very aggressive uh, team, even even our little guys. We're physical. We like to tie up, and we are going to throw you, toss you. Uh, if, if you don't shoot on us and we get a hold of you, you know, we, we have a, a, some great – you know, series that we work on, throw series, uh, headlock series, and front headlocks. And, I mean, we, we're known for that at Rich, and we're physical. And when these kids tie up to us, they're going to get thrown. And, and it was fun to watch. We we threw a lot of kids. Uh, they were pretty tentative towards the end of the, the day when they were wrestling Rich. That You always got to be aware. Uh, I teach my kids, you are one move away from a pin, either way. But no matter what or what the score is, you are one move away from pinning the kid and getting a win in wrestling. And that's the neat thing about it is, you know, I just teach them to always believe in yourself and always believe that you can pull out a, a move or a throw at any point and stick a good kid. And we did. We won matches where we were outmanned, where they had more wrestling experience on the mat. You could see it. It was evident. But we caught them in throws that we've practiced and moves that we've practiced, and that's the end of the match. Anything else you want to touch on, Coach? No, I'm looking for a great positive season. Uh, as principal, I couldn't be more proud of, of the other teams as well. Girls and boys, we had a great weekend. Uh, came up short on one of the boys' games, but they played great. Uh, I couldn't be more proud of the, the whole, uh, what our kids are doing in this school attitude-wise. Uh, they are just believing in the programs, believing in their coaches, and giving the 100%. And that's what we can ask, and that's all we can ask. And I couldn't be more proud of all the kids here at Rich High School. Rick Larson, wrestling coach and principal at Rich High School. Thanks for your time. Thank you. Appreciate it, Ryan.